You and your partner might currently sense a disconnection because both of you are dedicated to personal growth, aiming to rebuild your relationship with newfound confidence and vulnerability. There may be some pressure felt, along with sensations related to the third eye chakra, such as headaches, unease, and irritation. However, your telepathic communication is reaching its peak as it is being re-established. Your partner's personal growth is accelerating, and they are eager to reconnect with you. They can't wait to share what's been happening in their life. The faith in your reunion has been restored in both your hearts. Although there may be moments of sadness and overwhelming emotions, trusting in the universe's timing is essential. To strengthen your belief in this connection, consider meditating and connecting with your inner self. Everything else is unfolding according to the universe's plan. The person you care about is currently experiencing pain due to an approaching difficult period in their life. You are advised to provide them with support and understanding, even though you might feel upset, resentful, or frustrated. Try to approach this situation with compassion in your heart. The universe has guided them to this moment because it is what they need in order to learn to love themselves. The dark night of the soul, although challenging, is a necessary part of personal growth and transformation. During this time, it's best not to reach out to your person because the universe intends for you not to interfere. Allow them to go through their process of purging as they are being guided. Instead, focus on yourself and utilize your spiritual tools to stay grounded. Your person is also struggling with staying away from you. They hold deeper feelings for you than they have expressed. They yearn to return to you. You mean a lot more to them than they have let on. They want to be close to you using their affection and physical presence to demonstrate their emotional connection to you. They are literally craving your presence because their life is in turmoil and filled with intense pain. Your mere call or message would be like medicine to them because they believe your love has the power to heal their wounds. They miss you deeply and are praying to the universe to bring you back into their life. I'm apprehensive about yielding to this intense urge to reach out to you, whether by calling, texting, or rushing to be with you. My fear stems from not wanting to extinguish the remaining spark between us. I'm bewildered by my inconsistent behavior one day. I push you away, and the next day, I long for your love. I even convince myself that I can carry on without you. But then, out of the blue, I wake up with a painful void in my heart. In the past, I managed to bury my pain and stow away my emotions, carrying on with my life and responsibilities. However, lately, I can't seem to escape thoughts of you. It's not that I've ever stopped thinking about you. The difference is that you're alive in my mind heart and soul, yet physically distant. This internal struggle is tearing me apart. I'm struggling to resist the temptation to defy my fears. I'm upset, sad, and utterly lost. It feels like I'm battling the only emotion I know to be genuine my profound need for you. I can't make sense of my current state. Silently, I yearn to see you, touch you, hold you, kiss you, and make love to you. I don't know how much longer I can keep my distance. I've circled endlessly in my thoughts, searching for a way to be with you. But then my thoughts and feelings remind me that I'm not in a position to offer you the commitment and love you deserve. I'm terrified of causing you more pain, of getting too close, 
and of experiencing the agonizing loss of each other once more. I feel like I'm being dragged back into the dark abyss of hopelessness, emptiness, and sorrow all over again. Please, I need guidance. This message is for those with a codependent masculine energy. When I reflect upon myself, I find that I'm not pleased with what I observe. As I delve inward, I must admit that there's a presence of fear and self-doubt. There are times when I wish I could drown out my thoughts with deafening noise and escape from my own mind. It's as if I sometimes feel trapped, like a caged animal. I must confess that not a day goes by without thoughts of you occupying my mind. My thoughts and emotions seem to surge all at once. I discover myself yearning for you, desiring your presence, and loving you more than anything else. You've offered me so much love, and all I did was push it away. Our shared memories have resurfaced, and my soul aches to be with you. After you departed, I had no alternative but to turn inward to embark on a journey of healing. I sense my heart expanding in ways I've never experienced when I think of you. Even from a distance, I can feel the warmth of your affection. I'm conscious that there's still much I don't comprehend. I acknowledge and recognize the connection between us. The rebirth I'm undergoing wouldn't be attainable without the love and light you brought into my life. This transformation is accompanied by pain and anxiety, but I take pride in the person I am becoming more confident and self-assured. The path I've known thus far has been dark and constricting, but with you, this new path feels liberating and expansive. My beloved, I could perceive the universe propelling me, pushing me to become something I didn't believe I was ready for. But now, I recognize my own strength, and I understand the depth of love I am capable of. It's the same strength and love that I saw in you and that you saw in me. It just took some time for me to recognize it within myself. I am fully committed to nurturing our connection with honesty trust, and unwavering support. I eagerly await the moment when you open your heart to me once again, allowing me to express all that I hold within me face to face.